Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to Ultimate General Civil War. With me, your host, Lucky Marine, and it's the third day, maybe? The Battle of Cold Harbor. Anyway, I think the, the entire map has now opened up to us. So far, it's been boring as balls. Let's hope that it's a little bit better. I uh, swapped a few of the divisions around just so that the uh, reinforced right wasn't as weak as it was. Let's go. Brace yourselves, men. The Union Infantry is preparing for an all-out attack. Hold your positions. Oh, wait, what? What, well, right now? Okay. Uh, yeah, so. What are we left with? If they're attacking us, let's just pull back into semi-defensive positions. And wait what might be the, the initial attack out. So you, and you, and you. Let's get you up here. Let's have you run it. We'll shift you. Yep, we'll shift you along. Get you to run. To breathe into your position. Again. We're running. So have you moving up? Are you moving up as well? McLean. That spot there. Forest and law. Lot, forest. Get in the woods? No, in the forest. Uh, Stark. So, race you, you come out as well. Stark. Do we need to put you anywhere? You're covered, you're covered. That's covered. We could probably do with pushing out. Siegfried and Pettigrew. Therefore, we'll run Stark in that direction. I think that is it for the moment. Let's go on that. You should be running as should you. We'll split skirmishes off from watch. No, not watch. Vetch. Vetch? Yeah, Vetch. And just chuck them ahead of the line. We'll push Johnson just into here, give them a little bit more of a cover bonus. I don't know how 0 0.01 of his dudes have died already. Um, scurvy or something. Leprosy. Died of boredom, maybe. I, I could, I could imagine that. You're closer than you were before. Okay, you're in. Yeah, just stand there. You're ahead of the line. You're not spotted. See, Freed. Who's what? Who's firing at whom? Well, there's people out here. Alright, so it's firing into them. How about you not fire because there's no one near you? Again, don't fire till then somebody is near you. Nope. Baron. 
push up into that spot. Where's our 21 pounders? 24 pounders even. Deering. Yeah, go on then. I think Fisher's wasted down here. Guinness. McGuinness even. Uh, no, we'll, we'll, we'll keep them there. They know they're just out of range. Probably. Maybe they're just waiting for reinforcements. Maybe that's the thing. You're heading to there, let's have you heading up here. Also. Somebody here. Run out and try and flush them. Well, spot them. Bonjour. Can we spin to an extent that we're not spotted? Maybe these skirmishes at this point. All right, you pull back a little bit. Look like they're, they're trying to attack here, which is nice. Makes a change. Let's pull you back from the front. Flanking shots. All right, we'll pull Nelson a little further north. Stark here. We can utilize if we need. <clears throat> and you fire when ready. seen anything else. Seems to be the only contact for the moment. Let's have a look. We'll push. Skirmish is up a little bit. See if they can... what time is it? 5 o'clock in the morning. See if they can spot people on these defences. What do we need to win? 
doing this. At least one must be fulfilled. Hold Magnolia Wood. Done. All must be fulfilled. Currently on the road to victory. Okay, tower. Let's. Ooh. How did. So they saw across here more effectively than these guys saw beyond one bush. No, just fired it. Away. Hopefully we can get through these woods quicker than they can follow. I'll get on further up the line. Okay, we're going alright. Come on, get out of range. Excellent. Now we should be able to drag them all the way into this position here. We'll use tribute into the side of him when he merges and tower as well. This will last all day. Wait, no, we can do this all day. Now they're pushing this, for them. because they can't all sit together on top of each other, they're kind of squishing everybody further and further and further down, and closer and closer to straight and nickels. So we might even pull McLean out, just to join these two gaps. Join the two edges of these defences even. Oh, there it is. Is it the same one? Is it a different one? You go forward, you get on the defensive position. I know there were two units, there was one that followed us into the woods and there was one lurking behind. for it. You're finding the right people, you are. Yep, you are as well. As are you. Yep, we'll focus down Eustace there. We might push Nelson out there. Just to get definite flanking shots. No, we'll push McLean out there. Wilson Nelson behind Zook. Want you in this gap here and we'll get you off your horse. You in this gap here will get you off your horse. You'll just be added fire if um, if this descends into melee. Go 
and to watch me play my games. Hey, good boy. Yeah, I know. Learning how to say Zuck. I'll just move the uh, things around on my table just to accommodate you, my furry friend. There we go. Less of using the space bar as a pillar though. I already pause too much. Finnegan will get you off your horse as well. I just want them to sit in the in the gaps, either firing out or if this descends into melee, we've got people an added line behind to fire in just to turn them to route them away a little bit quicker. You can get yourself away. Asking you. Okay, so they're in here. We've got race firing into it because he's on the floor, so he, he doesn't have finicky horses to worry about. Hey, good's firing into it. You should be firing into this as well. You already are. Penrose won't stay there too long. That's a flank. Let's get you back into cover. We'll just harass these as much as we can with the three skirmishes we've got. Race, nope. I just told them how you weren't finicky. Don't turn me into a liar. continuing to focus on Zook, therefore McLean's just getting free shots. Nope, switch fire. Switch fire to Upton, he seems the closest. Or is it no, Eustace. Anything else that we can chuck in there? No, not really. Not without weakening the line in other places. Stark, maybe. No, we'll keep them warriors. Okay, he's about to fire. Let's run out of this cover. Three lots of skirmishes, shots into the side of Gran, that might route him. Right. He's just fired, which means we've got essentially a free shot here. You can get it away and get back into cover. We don't need to actually. I know it was good, wasn't it? Okay, uh, move up slightly. I'm worried of Bidwell turning around. And he's firing at home. You change. Into uh, side of trucks. 
pull the route trucks and then come back to where we were. Okay, come back. Sounds like a charge. Someone charging. How do this? Let's make sure that they don't charge too far. work and drop back a little bit. Allow them the space to march into. That looks like all we're doing here is offering resistance and they're seeing the resistance and then they're, they're shuffling up the line to try find a way through. However, we can get into the side of Egan there. This day might make up for the uh, the other days of it just being boring. And by make up for, I mean solely in terms of uh, the kills that we wanted. Lafayette McClaws is wounded. Again, hyper focused onto Morton, has no idea what's coming in the side. No, you guys are fine. In fact, go that way. And we'll drop back just a little bit. If we can get behind, I'll take out Whistler. In fact, all of you go that way. You're right there. A little bit of heavy breathing. Sleep again. Yeah, sleep again. We can get him behind, we'll, we'll take out Whistler with no problem. Bidwell, Tanit, there's another one or two floating around here. I'm sure they're going to get pulled across this field. Who are we firing at? Nobody. Well, that's good, isn't it? into those woods, tripping you follow, tower you follow as well. Surely get spotted as they're crossing this road but hopefully the uh, this area of woods here will recover them. charging let's try to no let's try to discourage them as much as we can 24 pounders are a really good discouragement tool That's a cannoneer, I believe. I 
Yeah, Barrett. That's unfortunate. Oh, Mr. Hancock there himself. Okay, so we're in behind the lines with our skirmishers. We should be able to remove this line and take out quite a few cannons, I think. I'm sure we have a supply truck around here somewhere. Let's get you over there. You're all fine. Barrett. I know you're dead, but switch on. You're all reloaded, I'm sure. Slightly. Next target. everyone's got targets. Barry you're firing at someone who is running away. Yep, that's all fine. Go on. Give me a juicy supplies. Now, go for welling. Supplies, you're coming with me. Let's get you firing at somebody who's not running away. This is going to be kind of fine. to get another. Yeah, you'll be alright. Hmm, maybe not. Smith has decided to charge, but I think if we pull him out into open ground, the cover bonus that skirmishers get against Smith, who is quite small, uh, we should be able to uh, overpower him, either route him from the field altogether, or at least get him out of the way so we can go and take out Welling and Hamlin. Right, so we're out of sight at the moment. I don't know who they're firing at because we're out of sight. Yeah, just there. All right. Let's lean you out. <laughs> McLean. Uh, let's lean you out a little bit. Just there, I think.
to grunt. I'll get on the array. Let's push up a little further behind on that. Wrong person. Fire up to Everyone else is fine. What's happening up here? Supplies. Stationary supplies. The left flank in danger. The left flank is in danger? Which? Where? Okay. Here we go. The left flank. The left flank in danger. Meanwhile, Burnside and Warrant Corps are mobilizing to assault our northern defenses. All church road must be. It's either northern defenses or it's left flank. You can't have both. Left flank defended, but not sufficiently to cover large front. So, enemy will surely attempt to breach our lines here. Okay. Well, let's get you off that defensive position. So that you're slightly more hidden. Who are you firing at? Oh, night time. Great. You jump off, you jump off. Instantly hidden. Brim, you are spare. We'll jump off these points until we desperately need to jump on them. And Graham can fill this gap. Oh, you step off as well. You're really going to walk past us. 100% cover. I think stepping off this defense has tempted them out to the open. Come on, you should be reloaded by now. Thomas? Okay, pull back a little bit. Man the defences. You man them. You man them. Alright, flanking shots into Robinson. Great. Grant, you come off. Very briefly. to pull Grant back. We'll fill that spot with skirmishes instead. Alright, because there you step off as well. Marshall's going to be an easy target there. I don't like these though. Fire. 
That should be a flank, I'm guessing. Alright, good, he's been turned away. What cover you in? 100%. Alright, defensive position, go. Right, not a moment too soon. Let's use Hill to try double up on Fighter. Well, let's try and win the individual little battles that we can. Well, that we can. Nope, he's headed back. Right, just to the edge of that forest then. quicker and we'll feed you in here somewhere. Go step step out, hit Schweitzer in the Schweitzer, Schweitzer, Schweitzer in the rear. Run and do it. Change your plan. There's a, a big lump heading this way, and it's just two units that are holding this line. It's going to be slow across that. In fact, we'll send some more people. Predominantly skirmishers, but they have the uses. Route, that's excellent. We should be able to push this three star away. We'll try that. I did say for him to aim at this, didn't I? Or did he just get within range of aim at the first thing you could see? Again, Andrews, you are hyper focused on Thomas, therefore, because is getting free shots into your side. This isn't so good. Well, at least we're still hidden. I think there's still people in here, so instead of trying to flank Hoffman with the actual unit, we'll just push skirmishes out there. And there's somebody here. Somebody's, somebody's flank is here. You shouldn't be a melee. Change focus to Andrews, just until airs come back, in fact. In fact. Let's push skirmishes out here. Seems to be a lot of units there. If they've dragged defenders from this point, then we'll, uh, we'll pull hill. And... Ledley? Ledley skirmishes. Uh, Hill and Ledley, the brigades, down here. Put some pressure on this flank. 
I'm not boring you. Me? Yeah, I know. Okay, let's go. Yeah, get yourself away. Let's push you forward. Should be able to turn Hoffman away there, hopefully. You go back. Those ones there. Yeah, I think they've pulled off this position altogether. Interesting decision. Flanked by whom? Who are you flanked by? Maybe Marshall? Right, we've got Custer there to just jump on the point. We can take Thomas and there uh, and put him in D. In Custer's place, where he gets his shit together. I think it was Marshall that flanked from this direction. really the case. I can't imagine so. You get yourself through there, you into these woods, and we'll use it to collapse into the rear of theirs. Uh, maybe even take out the fifth corps commander. Thomas, I'd like you right here. I don't think there's anyone down here. Although, we already know how battlefields can develop. Let's not assume. more people here than those before, which is nice. I think that's those kind of done with. We'll make sure with hill skirmishes. Somebody here. There's a cannon down here somewhere. Or a unit of a cannon. Let's have you just there. We can't allow Siegfried to get any further around Boyle, otherwise he'll flank him. Let's charge. Grant, you spin around. In fact, I'll just spin around on your axis there. And you come back. Don't know where you're going. Let's go snaffle some supplies if we can. Has descended into melee, however, we've got grain behind. We should be fine there. Right. 
put you back into the wood line a little bit. Out of range of the first Michigan <coughs> SS. Hmm. What an unfortunate name. Uh, and then take out with with Withington. Yep, Withington. We'll take out Withington. Want you to stop firing and run that way. Wilcox skirmishes are going to come under some quite heavy fire there and they're not in good terrain but we needed to halt Siegfried in advance Where do you think I'm going? What do we need you? I reckon we can get through that gap. Let's go. Will you stop with your head on the space bar, please? Uh, hill skirmishers just in here. Now we have Graham that can jump on a defensive position if he needs to. Uh, we'll bring Custer back. Let's pull you back into cover. More supplies done. I don't know if it's safe down here. So let's send you more. And that shall come south. Good step. Let's get you back into the fray. hidden so we'll bring you a little bit further down we'll get flanking shots into whoever's here go up into these woods Ledley this way to counter Withingham Withington oh Nice. Now should be a flank. I'm sure there's cannons here. Push you forward. cover but must have taken a step too far what's this 
Yeah, that's alright. We'll give them a prod. Let's get you into this wood. Flanked by whom? Why are you doing licking yourself? Alright, fine, you, you, you carry on. Alright, pull back a little bit. You try finish them off if you can. just firing at us not three minutes before and they've already forgotten who we were. I oh, know they haven't. Must have stepped forward a little too far. Another volley into Withington. Actually knows it's a restart. So, he's not going to break easily. What are, Dylan, what are you? You are determined, aren't you? Gonna fuck up his day. Alright, we'll go skirmishers. Let's get you interrupting these cannons. What are you firing into? First Michigan SS. You will have more morale than they have. Looks like we've entirely routed that three star. Just splendid. And we're no longer seen. Switch fire to go. What cover you in? 82%. 82% is fine. To just snaffle some supplies here. Let's do that. I'm surprised if they leave the field here. Um, oh well. Supplies will get you away as well. Were you not firing here? Should have been. Alright, Costa, I think I can bring you down now. Quite safely.
let's get you away. I wonder if a supply wagon can steal their own supply wagon. That's it. I'd hope not anyway. Should turn firing off. Anyway, what's happening in the rest of the map? No, don't fire at that. Yep, you continue to fire into that. It's a flank. Fair enough, but you should be able to. Uh, Back to Ziegler, and you carry on. We don't have long left. Someone's running out of ammunition, but I don't think we have a supply truck on this map. We did well, we stole some of our saddles. Battle continues along something, 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 something. General, we inflict heavy casualties to the enemy, but they keep coming. They keep coming, Dan. They keep coming. I know. We can afford more losses, but we cannot afford a breach in our defences. Don't let them pass through. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I know it's bad. Now let's, let's have a look what's going on here, shall we? Are you going into our, our position? You lot had your orders as well. fashion so you're not bundled together. First of all you'll take out Welling, second two will probably uh, route Hamlet. The can's firing it. Yep, that's acceptable. Concentrate on Smith. Concentrate on Smith, you stay here. So you get flanks onto Smith. In the meantime, there's there's nothing down here really. 
We are getting attacked in the north. Skirmish seem to be doing a decent job of just holding them at bay for the time being. In her face, you're already firing. Next one, look. You two continue north. You try and tie in. Try and tie Smith up. Yeah, this is all right. It's acceptable. Okay, guess I'll wait. I suppose if they're facing us and they're charging us over here, they're not, they're not charging the defences. And apparently we've disappeared from view. Nobody knows where we are. So we'll sit there. Tempting target. We'll go for that. If we can get there in time. And get some boy. You two are still hidden. You should be continuing to fire. Great. Which means you've eliminated the unit that was spotting you, so you're suddenly unspotted. And Cross is going to turn and walk away. You. There we go, something like that. Skirmishers just through the centre. We attach the skirmishers, let's pull you away now. Out VH, even as a whole unit. That's better. do seem to have concentrated in the center. So we're getting more people attack us now. It is not quite so boring. Let's eliminate the skirmish as well again. And then fall back from that. Why 
Why do you not have the range for this? You don't have to turn your whole... Do you? Alright, go. We're getting attacked in the north, I think. Maybe not. Looked like a charge, but it never really materialised. We're doing well there. We pop out, get fully away, and we're already out of sight by the time uh, he's turned to face us. Shayla, push her out. And taking advantage of the fact that Brooke and Stedman are hyper focusing on uh, on Siegfried. targets. You move out until you can... Actually, uh, that's melee now. Stark. Let's pull you out here. This is all fairly static. Why do you need to reload? Have you... When did you fire your weapons? Almost at some point they, they did already have kills stacked up. Is there another charge somewhere? Something here. Nope. Oh, hello. Here you are. North and try help out against Custer. I'm sure we killed him before. Maybe not. We'll pull Shadow out. Have Stark ready to fight as well. Another volley on McDougal. McDougal, probably. Dead man, I think. 
You got it. You got north. You two. Oh, you might be able to catch him. Again, it's dragging people away from the fight. From the sneaking maneuvers, Pettigrew's got 387 kills to 4 deaths. Let's do it again. Like it, it's fun. He didn't even turn to face that time. Pull you back slightly. Nope. Back on the defensive position. Off you go. It's not out style, you are welcome. Siegfried, how are you getting on? 285 deaths. Oh, of course, Siegfried skirmish is here. Not that we really need you anymore. We might do. These skirmishes might be giving us the vision here. We'll keep them out for the time being. What's up? Yep. What's up? Me? It's nearly food time, isn't it? Right, well, let me just finish it. Oh, I've only got two hours to go. Game time. And then you can go off your food, right? Just, just be, just be a normal cat for once, right? Oh, can I? Go take advantage of that. Would be rude not to. No, that way. in such a stupid way. I'm not complaining. I am a little bit. I mean, you want a challenge, don't you? like this area has quietened down a little bit they've tried to or the, they're attempting to probe the middle there's a big skirmishing unit they've got probably sit here for a while because they'll keep trying to come back, especially if uh, he loses sight of us.
Come on, skirmishers, let's finish this job. <clears throat> Excellent. Out trust that Custer's done with. I mean, they're stacked up as if they want, as if they're going to rush us, but there's no evidence of it actually happening. They're well within canister, not canister, they're well within cannon range. I don't see what the plan is. It does, it does. It does almost make the other two stages um, of this grand battle. Almost makes it worth it. If we get enough kills here. It was very boring though, wasn't it? more cannons. If it gives us more time to complete this fight, we might just wrap them up. We know most of, most of this is empty. Still having not done the other uh, two days of Cold Harbor, I have no idea how the battlefield developed, so we'll not commit to it too soon. these suddenly come from. Uh, Frank. And Elder. I feel like this is a good opportunity to fire. Yeah, you brought that point yourself. focused on one area of the map. So you into the back of Hamlet. Alright back into cover. You get back into cover. And you. Into cover. Go. 
Or just die. I mean, you could just die as well. So we're left with two units up here, one unit down here. Just leave that for the time being. Advantage of Mundo will hyper focus in again. A little bit quicker than that. Okay, I'm back. Discover. It's got snap all these supplies. And who's this? It's on the map. Somebody's here, I think. Here. Destroy them. Rather snuffle them though. Well then. Now ah, let's get away. Supplies will just hide you in these woods. the edge of these woods again. We might be able to uh, get another supply wagon. Bryce has done good work, as has Pegram. And Haygood. Yeah. Barrett, even though his dude died. And let's speed this up. Straight's done good work. And all he's doing is firing ball shot into the uh, flanks of the enemy here. That looks pretty much it. Let's uh, uber fast forward. Oh, we are now 
empty. We have more spies there. You get yourself out of the back. Something here. Let's go see what it is. Oh, no, no, it's not. Last 10 minutes. I see him. They've just sat here, not even in range. Well, in range of cannon, but not in range of us. Just taking a beating. They continue the attack on the. Oh, how many days? How many phases? Continuation of this attack. Well, bravely so far, but the enemy still threatens our left flank. Push them back and it will be all over. So I think this is the last action. That was a little nasty, but let's continue. Good to Ziegler. You're continuing down here to try and snaffle supply wagons. Graham, let's push you through, Thomas. Get shots on fighter. Looks like Curtin has decided to come and join the party. Let's uh, head him off. better cover. You get yourself white. Luckily, now that this guy has moved out of his position, we're free to roam. Let's run you in tall. Keep him out of cover as much as we can. Skirmishers around the back. You into the side. They shouldn't last too long. surrendered excellent now stop trying to kill the beans go more surprise excellent again please stop killing all the surprise Shear out, shear out, dominate this cover ourselves. Now let's get you into this gap. Mm, how about no? You run. Ah, I'm 
must have been a flank from Griffin. Damn you, Griffin! this field. Right now you can concentrate on the fighter. You move forward. Can't control Custer just yet. Custer? Yeah Custer. Now let's pull you back in. Hold all church, hold TSA left flank, capture Bethesda church. This one must be fulfilled and we've got all the rest. This is going to be nasty if uh, Simpson opens up. Interface. You continue. And you. We'll push Graham past the fighter so that one of them has got a flank. Pokemon. Push you further into the centre. We'll take out Frank. And Christ is it? Christ? Christ? I don't know. volley and you didn't fuck Frank. Evidently not. You use the side of right then. Yeah, I need you to run and boil. Let's get you in here as well. some decent cover here. Oh, I'll give you up. Do you find a nobody on you? Continue to move. You continue to fire as well. Apparently, that was the thing that had been going on for far too long. You move, you move. You spin yourself around.
Cool. Nope, fire this. On you. I'd really like to route the three star unit. Your push. Who are you firing at? Let's at least get you into the flank. You hold the way you are. There's cannons around here. Yep, there you go. To get these guys involved, isn't it? Hmm? Come. On. Let's go play with them. Let's run. Apart from you two. I need you two to uh, kind of sort yourselves out a little bit. No, you shuffle that way. And you just move yourself forward. You ever so slightly so you don't get flanked. Pull you into this space. And push you forward. What are you doing with the microphone, you silly cat? Me? Eh? You can't eat it. Take out the cannons if you can. You continue to move. You fire at something, anything. Could actually do with the supply wagons be down here. There's a few people running out of rounds and such. Good work. Press on. forward to meet them in relatively open ground. We'll push these two up as well. Why you're facing the other way I don't know. Another canyon unit gone. up in this corner. Okay, so you four move down as a unit. You three come up behind them. Someone surrendered. Okay, let's get you away. We have secured Bethesda Church. Okay. 
You two move as well. Broken rendered. Alright. Let's keep out as well. Running. Take the shot and run across that river into some more cover. Do it by hand. There. I need to move as well. We'll squid you out to the side. We'll close the door here. We'll get these three shifted a little, a little bit. Yeah, I know it's exciting. Excellent. Push through those woods. Let's get you out of the center so you don't get retaken. You don't count either, I'm sorry. Take you off the battlefield and you seem to be going the right way. Yep. And on we go. decided to do there but it's a good job that getting skirmishes were in front of them to take that fire not long now done Whew. victory at cold harbor hooray hooray indeed Dylan hooray They're much better numbers than we had before. Granted, it was boring in the middle. At the start and in the middle, it was just... It was horribly, horribly boring. But... I'll have to go back on the, the other video that I put up of the first day victory of Cold Harbor and see what the casualty rates are. I seem to remember that we killed about 8,000 of his, so this... It's obviously a lot better. Probably really well to say that he died. I think, did he? 
Yeah, well, that's unfortunate. Lafayette McClaws was wounded. Quite a few promotions. Nice. Holy moly. Holy cow. Yeah, it's uh <clears throat> it's worth grabbing those supplies. This is essentially itself in money. So twenty-four thousand in supplies. Twenty-four, twenty-four, twenty-one, twenty-three, twenty-five thousand in supplies. This amount of uh, helps various captured. Rescued two of our twenty-four pounders. I expected a few more rifles picked up, but you can't have everything. Done. Wow, that was a long one. That's exactly what she said. Oh. So then cross of honor. So, 150,000 and 15,000 in reputation. I don't think it takes into account your the money that you get from supplies. Because suddenly we're at 2.2 .2 million. And we weren't there before. We were close to 2 million. Right there. Anyway, 15,000 recruits. 16,000 if you include the, uh, the prisoners that we ex exchanged. To loss of was it eight thousand? Six thousand five hundred. That's not bad, is it? We'll grab. Nope. There's nobody in the academy. Are you willing to give me stuff now? You are. Immediately twenty-four pound howitzers. They pay for themselves grab them. Any peoples? There are no peoples. I mean there are peoples, there are pe many peoples, but there's not trained peoples. But next fight will be 80 what? No, actually. Um, when we pulled off the first day victory at Cold Harbor, it still said that they were going to get about 80 odd thousand. So. We've just messed them up. At Cold Harbor. Dragging that out for three days. When we really didn't need to. And we wiped 30 odd thousand. Off their numbers. And they've still only been. Reinforced with 80 something thousand. So. First day victory at Cold Harbor, even though it's doable, it's probably not the best thing to do. I mean, if, you, if you're running low on manpower, if you want the fight without the hassle, then fair enough. But I think you're just putting off to another day the issue, the, um, the, the, yeah, if you know what I mean. I mean, Cold Harbor is a very much a defensive fight. It's them throwing themselves against you. It's very easy to rack up a lot of kills. Um, had I known, I'd have probably chucked a lot more cannons into our center. But not having done the Cold Harbor thing uh, for the, the full three days, I, I had no idea where the attacks were going to come from. But next fight will be, I believe, Halls of Ferry. 14th of September, I think at this point it becomes purely a, histor a historical. Harding Pike, so 14th, 15th. What are you doing? That's. That, no, that belongs to the microphone. It doesn't belong to you. You can't rub your smell all over it. Harding Pike, and then last but not least, Washington. Got minus ten percent enemy army size for victory at Cold Harbor. 
We might be alright. We might be alright. We can gain 21,000 and yeah. Oh, I remember these. I remember these. Yeah, if you're looking at these and thinking, yeah, we can stockpile a load of men before we get to Washington. Mm -mm, nope. Both Hall's, Fe Halls Ferry and Harding Pike are a bitch to do. But you'll have to see that in the next episode. I'll be like Green as always. You lot have been amazing. The uh, the, the cat on my lap at the moment is Dylan. He's been very noisy, and is it nearly free time? <coughs> yeah, it's nearly free time. So until next time, do take care.